Hello. Today we propose you to discover species of turtles that you have never seen before. You will see that all the turtles in the world do not necessarily look like Franklin, the good old turtle of our childhood. You can hold it in the palm of a hand, it is white chocolate, it has tiny black eyes, no it is not a small hamster, it is an albino turtle out of the ordinary. The one you see here was born on September 16, 2015, in the valley of the tortoises of Soride, in the Pyrenees Orientales, to the great surprise of the members of the animal park that welcomed her. This little Bogari turtle, of Mediterranean origin, weighed only 14 grams at birth, it was four times lighter than a hen's egg. Very rare and exceptional, it requires special attention because it is extremely sensitive to natural and artificial light, just like albino human beings. On the other hand, some scientists do not agree with the name albino and rather think that the turtle is what is called a hypomelanistic turtle. According to them, its white color is simply due to a deficit in melanin. The animal seems to have been born under a very bad star since, in addition to its particular appearance, the turtle suffers from a heart deformity. Its heart has developed outside of the thorax and is therefore flush with the lower part of its shell. In addition to this, it ages prematurely and its eyes are particularly fragile. As a tribute to its singular situation, the little turtle was nicely named Hope. The park's caretakers are taking good care of the little white beast because this specimen is almost unique in the world. When the sun is shy on some autumn days, the park's caretakers say that Hope is less shy. The Valley of the Turtles also tells that Hope has an ogre's appetite. She likes small shrimps, frozen inland silverside, clams, snails and frozen bloodworms. A rather complete menu for which you naturally need the stomach of a giant and above all the heart to hold on to. The snake neck turtle is a freshwater aquatic turtle. It belongs to the family Chelidae and is now threatened with extinction. It can be found in the wild only on two Indonesian islands, Rodi Island and the eastern part of Timor Island. As its name suggests, the snake neck turtle has a particularly long neck in proportion to its size. This turtle is a nocturnal animal, however, it can still be seen out of the water by day during the rainy season in November. As far as her food is concerned, lettuce and other plants don't satisfy her, Madame is a gourmet since this species is mainly carnivorous. It feeds on fish, small amphibians as well as mollusks. Its hunting technique is astonishing, the snake neck turtle hunts on the lookout by propelling its head forward. Once its prey is in front of it, it grabs it with a deep breath and then exhales the water. Repeated sampling of wild populations of snapping turtles has led to a large decline in the number of individuals of this species. So much so, that the snapping turtle, which until then had the status of vulnerable species, was in the year 2000 in the category endangered species and thus joined the sad list of the 25 most endangered turtles on the planet. And by the way, if you like this video, don't forget to give us a like, subscribe to the channel, and activate the bell to receive all the notifications and not miss out on any of our upcoming content. We We'll keep going. Here is a kind of turtle with a big head, and this time we mean it literally. Platysternin megacephalum, more commonly known as big-headed turtle, is a species of aquatic turtle with large heads. This species is very well known for being an excellent climber since it can climb almost like a monkey to the trees near the water points where it lives. To do this, the big-headed turtle uses its beak and uses its tail as an accessory to extend the reach of its powerful claws. Ironically, the big-headed turtle is a poor swimmer, even though it is aquatic. The funniest thing about about this species of turtle is that it can't stick its head into its shell like other turtles once it feels danger lurking around it, and the least funny thing about it is that to defend itself it will not hesitate to use its powerful jaws and bite you if you inadvertently bother her. You've been warned. We promise you that today you will see turtles you have never seen in your life. This one is called the Malachlamese terrapin turtle, an aquatic species that includes seven subspecies distributed on the east and south coast of the United States, more precisely on a narrow coastal strip on the Atlantic side. It can be found in the Keys in Florida, Cape Cod in the north, or Texas. Adult specimens measure up to 24 centimeters for females and 14 centimeters for males. This turtle is characterized by a carapace whose colors can vary from brown to gray, and by a body that can sometimes be gray, brown, yellow, or white. This varies from one subspecies to another. Malachlamese terrapin turtles also have black dots of varying size and density on the body, which gives their coat a very original appearance. As far as the diet of the terrapin malachlamese is concerned, it is mainly composed of crustaceans, small crabs, shrimps, marine worms, mussels, and even oysters. Although their jaws are adapted to break the shells of mollusks and crustaceans, they do not say no to the occasional small fish. Look at this beautiful turtle with a starry shell. The Indian star tortoise is a land tortoise that belongs to the family Testudinidae. 
It is native to India in the states of Tamil Nadu, Kerala, Karnataka, Gujarat, and Rajasthan. It can also be found in Sri Lanka. This species of turtle is not capricious, it is easily adapted to several living environments. Its preferred terrains can be green spaces as well as dry savanna. Its dark brown or even black shell is bulging, elongated, and nicely decorated with stars. This turtle is characterized by the absence of scales on its nuchal part. It measures between 20 and 30 centimeters and can weigh up to 5 kilograms for the largest specimens. Kiora macordi is a turtle belonging to the Geoimidity species. It can be found mainly in China. It is only very recently, in 2005, that a team of scientists discovered the natural habitat of the species in Guangxi, at a time when the species had already almost disappeared from the wild. In 2008, a detailed scientific study of Kiora macordi's habitat revealed that the turtle was a semi-aquatic or even terrestrial species. As with most turtle species, males are slightly smaller than females, 13.5 centimeters for a male and 15 centimeters for a female. On the other hand, they have thicker and longer tails and a more elongated and flatter carapace. The Kiora macordi indeed looks a lot like the one we almost all had at home when we were little, but this one stands out from the others with a bib marked with large black and yellow spots. This species reproduces easily, however it is nowadays in danger of extinction, especially because of international trade. Because it is an easy species to collect, the wild population of Kiora macordi has been in rapid decline since it was first discovered. The turtle you see there and the one you find on almost every brochure for an idyllic vacation in the West Indies, Mayotte, or Reunion Island, since it usually lives close to the coast in all the tropical seas of the globe. It is most often found near coral reefs where it finds refuge in underwater caves, but it can also be observed in lagoons, bays, estuaries or in the open sea during migration phases. Hawksbill turtles are aquatic species, and also excellent swimmers. Scientists who have taken an interest in this species have recorded spikes at 24 km per hour for 5 km. Who said that turtles are slow animals? The hawksbill turtle measures between 60 and 100 cm and weigh between 43 and 75 kg. The largest specimen found measured 127 centimeters. It is found in tropical and subtropical waters and has no teeth but a horny beak to shred its food. This species is omnivorous, it feeds on plants in the first weeks of its life, then, from the second month, it eats sponges, sea urchins, crabs, corals, and all kinds of invertebrates such as cephalopods. Between the 1940s and 1950s, the trade that developed around hawksbill turtle shells seriously endangered this species. Indeed, the latter was highly sought after after and coveted for the superior quality of its scales. In fact, today, its flesh can be found on the stalls of Asian markets and its shell can be found in souvenir stores. What a shame! Batagor basca, or if you prefer the northern river terrapin, is a water turtle that belongs to the family Geomydidae. This extraordinary species can be found in Orissa, West Bengal, India, Indonesia, Bangladesh, and Burma. It tends to frequent fresh and brackish waters. The Sun Darbans River Turtle has an unusual appearance, a flat, smooth shell with a wingspan of up to 60 cm and a reddish flesh. The species is omnivorous, feeding mainly on shoreline plants and small animals such as mollusks. The Northern River Terrapin is on the IUCN 2012 list of the 100 most threatened species in the world. And if it is extremely threatened it is partly because of hunting, for its flesh and eggs, so much appreciated by the Chinese. For the conservation of this species, hatchery and captive breeding projects have been established in Bangladesh and India. At present, nearly a hundred individuals are in captivity in Sajnakali. They represent one of the largest colonies of the species. A captive population of equal size is managed in Bawal National Park in Bangladesh by TSA, Vienna Zoo, and IUCN Bangladesh. Take a good look at this animal. No, it is not a toad but a turtle. Actually, it is a doll's toad-headed turtle. There is no need to point out that its appearance is enough by itself. This turtle looks strangely like a toad. This critically endangered freshwater species is mostly found in the ponds, streams, and swamps of northern Colombia, but lives mainly on land. The doll's toad, headed turtle has a beautiful oval to elliptical shell, olive to brown, with a slightly serrated back edge. Its plastron is well developed and notched back. His head is large and broad with a slightly prominent muzzle and a notched upper jaw. The dorsal surface of the head is covered with small and large irregularly shaped scales. Males have longer and thicker tails and narrower heads than females. On the other hand, those of the females are slightly swollen behind the eyes. 
Some time ago, an incredible photo made the rounds of the social networks. It showed a gigantic military truck carrying a huge turtle. In the caption that accompanied the picture, it was specified that it was the largest turtle in the world found in the Amazon or a giant turtle captured after the accident in Fukushima. The message also said that the giant turtle weighed almost 400 kilograms and was 529 years old. But this larger-than-life picture was not a real picture, it was actually a giant model of a turtle that was being transported to shoot a scene from the Japanese movie, Gamera the Brave. In one scene of the movie, the injured turtle was taken to a research center in military transport, hence the image that was captured. In the movie, the Gamera turtle has special powers, it grows very fast and can fly, which supports the hypothesis that it was just a giant model turtle. On the other hand, if the massive beast shown in the picture was really real, it would certainly weigh much more than 400 kilograms due to its gargantuan size. So what do you think of these incredible and unusual turtle species? Which one impressed you the most? Tell us in the comments.